Um, welcome everybody, uh, my name is Michelle English, I know a lot of you here, um, but not everybody. Um, I'm the Associate Director of Sustainability at the City of Adelaide and um, I'm very pleased to be here uh, with the City of Adelaide and the Department of Environment um, and Water putting on this event for you today. So I'd first like to acknowledge that we're meeting on the traditional country of the Kaurna people of the Adelaide Plains and pay respects to Elders past and present. We respect and recognise their cultural heritage, beliefs and relationship with the land. And we acknowledge that they are of continuing importance to the Kaurna people living today. And we'd also like to extend those respects to other Aboriginal language groups and other First Nations that might be here today. So I'd like to welcome the Honourable Rachel Sanderson, MP, State Member um, of Adelaide and Minister for Child Protection. Thank you very much for coming along, Rachel. Um, as the Member for Adelaide, Rachel has a keen interest in sustainability and supporting their community in their interests in, in moving towards our local and global environments. Um, recently, she hosted an information night that um, over 100 members of the public attended um, on solar energy and battery storage options. So she's well aware of the community's appetite for low carbon. Um, also attending is Di Favia. Di is a manager um, of climate change at the Department of Environment and Water and we'll be hearing for her, from her later as she t takes us through the workshop. Thank you, Michelle. Um, so, as I've mentioned, the Department of Environment and Water and the City of Adelaide um, are really the partners behind the Carbon Neutral Adelaide um, Partnership Project. So we work together to support our partners. We've got over 160 partners. Um, and we know that many of you here today are members of that group. So I would like to also welcome um, Sandra Chan. Where'd you go? Sandra Chan, here she is, um, Senior Advisor for Policy and Government Relationships for the Green Building Council. Um, the Green Building Council is a supporter of the Carbon Neutral Adelaide Program and they also manage the Green Star Certification Program. Lastly, I'd like to recognise that we're here in this wonderful building, um, the Majestic Roof Gardens Hotel, which is one of the properties owned by the Colshaw Group. And the Colshaw Group um, is actually a founding member um, of uh, the Carbon Neutral Adelaide Partnership Program as well. And they have done a lot of work in adopting sustainable technologies um, and reducing their emissions. So it's nice to be here supporting our partners. So in terms of housekeeping, um, all those sort of general things. As you came up in the lift, just to your left out there are the bathrooms. Um, and in the unlikely event of an emergency, you will be directed out actually out to the right there, enjoying the view as you then proceed down the stairs. Um, so, can I just say that we are absolutely thrilled to have you all here today. We, when we were looking at having this event, we thought maybe we'd get 20 people. We weren't really sure, and it's just been um, such, in fact, we have a wait list, but it's been such an incredible um, uh, you know, opportunity for us to understand the number of businesses uh, in our city that are actually very interested in taking this low carbon journey. So carbon neutrality, as you know, is very much a leadership position. And we have a number of leaders here uh, in this room that you'll hear from. Um, so what I find is really interesting is while carbon accounting and carbon neutrality is, has really in the past been very much within the remit of those large organisations, what we're starting to see is a real shift. And we're having small and medium businesses that are actually taking the lead as well. So they're stepping up really ahead of the curve. Um, and voluntarily measuring um, and reducing their emissions. And it's a really exciting place as we see all sectors moving. Because indeed, if we are going to hit our um, Paris commitments, we actually need everybody to move. And that's why we're here. It's about everyone taking action. So I'm really excited that we actually have three tiers of government here. So we've got local government, state government, and we also have the um, federal government here as well. And we have business and we have not-for-profits. And it's basically all of us 
that need to be taking action to reduce our emissions. So we've got the right people in the room. So it's very exciting. What you're going to do, what we're going to do first today is you're going to hear from um, three partners that are managing their emissions um, as part of just their good business practice. Um, and what's also quite exciting is through the partnership group, we actually have a number of organisations that are actually, their service model, what their business is, is providing support for businesses who want to reduce emissions. So that's part of this um, network. So if you're one of those businesses and you've got people who are interested, talk to them on your table. It's the whole idea of actually networking and connecting people. So um, we're very excited. The City of Adelaide has um, a commitment to reduce um, its own emissions and our target for the last 10 years has been to do, um, to become carbon neutral by 2020, so next year. Um, but we also um, see our role as very important to support our community to reduce emissions. Um, and as a council, we have been um, accounting for our own emissions over the last couple of years, but we also support businesses and our households um, to um, reduce emissions. And one of the ways we do that is through the Sustainability Incentive Scheme. So since 2015, um, the Department of Environment and Water and um, the City um, of Adelaide have actually co-invested in this scheme. And about a million dollars in investment has actually um, leveraged seven million dollars of investment in sustainable technologies within the City of Adelaide. So it's very, very exciting. Um, what I'm particularly excited to tell you about is last week our council uh, endorsed a range of new measures. So as you'll see, we're not going to talk about them in detail now, but basically we've introduced a range of measures to support you to become carbon neutral. Um, and we think that's really important. Our role is to take action ourselves, but support those who want to take a leadership position as well. Um, in addition to those, we have another, you know, a range of other um, uh, rebates available for neighbours and Green Star certification as well. And there are many of our staff here and the department staff that will be able to help you with that later. But now, for our speakers today, while you're really here, um, we're very proud to have both local um, and international organisations here in this vanguard today who can um, speak to you and share their experiences. Uh, following that, we're going to have a 30-minute workshop session um, and then you'll be able to discuss what you've heard at your table.